tonight, the class of 1941, Goldsboro High School will be celebrating its 55th reunion at the home of Hortense Lyles Rouse in Walnut Creek. The festivities will be in the house and the back and on the lake. We see some of the members coming in now. This is the, the back porch, the back side of the home of Hortense Lyles Rouse, where the festivities will be taking place. Class members are coming in now. Class members, which one is the class I, member? I am Lillian Jenkins Dixie, my husband, oh. John Dixie. Well, we're glad to be here. Yes, we are. <laughs> the class member's here. Which one is the class member? I'm the class member. She's class a class member. member. You're a class right. member? Yes, I'm the class member. And your name is? Edith Ginn. Edith Ginn. Edith Massingill Ginn. All right, and? Dorothy Smith Daniels. All right, Dorothy. We have, who is this now? G.L. Ginn. Classmate. You're not, you're a visitor, I'm so? Class member. I'm Grab it, and I'm in the class of 41 and 42, and I almost flunked both of them. <laughs> you're Ida Bell Benton Harris, and you're the class member. Yes, class member 41. Right. I see you a lot at the mall. Bill. And you're the class member? This is Ann. Come on over, Bill. Class member, but that's all right. I'm not either. Okay. And your name? I'm Ann Futrell. Ann Futrell. Any kin to George? Yes. A sister-in-law. George Futrell? Yeah, I'm his brother, Bill. And you're Bill Futrell. Okay. Uh, George was in the class of me in 1943. Oh, you took, you took, uh, you took videotape of their class reunion. That's you right. We saw it. What is signing in at this point? That's right. We're all here at the desk. This is one of the committee. We have a line. And, and uh, I didn't get that name. I was with the Right, I saw Donald outside. Signing in. They're beginning to come in tonight. We expect a big crowd. And people sign in at the front door at the home of Hortense Lyles Rouse. They head out the back where we'll have the barbecue dinner. One of the, are you one of the class members? She is. Um, yes, yeah, I, I remember you. And then what is your name? Your name for a minute there. Virginia. Virginia. Yeah, oh, yeah. Uh -huh. Donnie Pelt. We, 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 Donnie we Pelt. I was Donnie Pelt. 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 So the members signed in and had a little visitation on, inside of the home of Hortense Lyles. Came on the back porch of the deck for refreshments. There's some of the members there having refreshments. Everybody is having a good time. Milk. White rice. Is that pasteurized milk? All right, I'll buy that. Oh, the class member, the class of 41, and his name is... You're trying to ask me what my name is? Yes, huh? James Jeffries. Uh, hey, aren't we glad she Okay, this way I get everybody talking on the tape. Well, I can't talk too good with my uh, recent problems, but I'm glad to be here. I am too. Now we have some more members. Which one is the class member? Both. Both. You're both? Yes. And your name? Annie Louise Baker Kearney. Annie Louise Baker Kearney? I'm saying the whole thing because so that they, might, they can put it together. <laughs> well, that's good. And your name? I am Sally Sandlin. Best Riddle. I have so many names. <laughs> Sally Sandlin. Uh -huh. Yep. And your uh, your sister was a high school teacher? Yes, she was. And sister she taught Jack. me? That's right, she did, and she's coming to the party tomorrow night. So well, she will bless her heart. Us. Maybe I'll get to dance with her. Well, I hope you will, because she loves to dance. Mm. Oh, we're out on the... Uh, Back lawn, this is where the barbecue from Wilbur's will be served. Good crowd now coming in. Others in their home where we just left. We have a special event here. We have Lee and Jenkins. Now, Lee and Jenkins was a class member of the class of 1941, Goldsboro High School. 
she, she got so married, and then when she got married to, married to John Dixon, Dix decided to join the group. Now, back to the story, when they got married, we have tonight present the three bridesmaids that were at the wedding of Leon and John. And the first one is Sally Sambrin. And now she is Bess Riddle. Biddy Misher Graham. There's Virginia Weatherly Holton. Virginia Weatherly Holton. Now, we're going to take a shot with them all together, just one moment. A little better shot with all of them in there at a distance. We were closer earlier so we could get the voice and everything. But that's a happy looking bunch, everybody's smiling, so John and Virginia is real happy. <laughs> Say cheese. This is Ellen Summerlin Smith, one of the class members. She's our workhorse. 1941. Horse. She is the workhorse, huh? She is absolutely without a doubt the workhorse. And I came out with her tonight as her visitor. <laughs> and we're fixing to eat the barbecue. Now we have. Well, call me. I was, this is Frank. Doris Helms Medlin. Bobby. Bobby. Bobby Helms. All right. Okay. I remember. I remember Bobby. What was your brother's name? Marshall, the physics teacher. Oh. Science teacher. Yeah. Oh, I remember Mr. Helms. Yeah, I made a radio at his class one time. Yeah. Now we got you to say something on tape. Oh, gosh, you going to hold it against me? No. Huh? <laughs> I like you. The people that watch this tape might. Like What's Russell's last name? Singleton. Russell? Russell? Hey, you got to hear it. Sorry about your foot. Yeah, well, let's get it. Yeah, well, let's get it. That cast comes off. It does. I have you on tape. What will, and you're, you're the class member, right? No, I. He's the class member. Now, what what's his name? Rutledge, Claude Rutledge. Claude Rutledge. And your wife? He's Mabel. Mabel Rutledge. Have a reunion. Well, from the big high school Paulsboro. From where? <laughs> Never have heard of it. <laughs> Zeke? Bill? Huh? You think there's any fish in there? Oh, yeah. Huh? Bad. You ever called in? Not in. Yeah, I have. Yeah. It's Ida Bell Benton Harris as she looked at Goldsboro High School in 1941. And Harris as she looks in 1996, 55 years later. No, we had the we had the uh, the graduation diploma for Ida Bell Benton. This is another retake on the picture of Ida Bell Benton as she looked in the class of 1941, Goldsboro High School. Where be? How do you say that, David? Willoughby. Willoughby. Okay, now. And this is his mother, and she was in Margaret Waters, Margaret Waters class of 41. Well, hey, Frank, you should remember me. I do, but I just want you to talk some on tape. He wants you to talk on the tape. Dot. <laughs> Let's see, now, you're Dot. I belong to Donald Herring. Donald Herring. Okay, now, you were the class member. No, I was not. Donald was. Hanging on. Uh -huh. And you're a visitor. Well, I'm glad to be here. I'm a visitor, too. Amateur it's fun. It's fun. fun. I intend to enjoy it. Donald. Now, we have the class member. That's right. I'm just hanging on to him. You're hanging on to him? For dear life. Okay, there you are. At least he's standing over you. <laughs> Or says he's not a class member. But that don't make any difference because we get everybody's picture to come over here. Anybody that has a good smile like that. Okay, where is Donald Harris? Dot Harris. Okay. Um, she's around here somewhere. Dot's, um, Dot was known as Jitterbug in high school and she's still sort of a Jitterbug and she floats around a lot. So I don't know oh, she thinks she might be off somewhere Jitterbugging? She might be. <laughs> and I found Dot Harris, and she's not jitterbugging. Oh. And I thought, <laughs> and your husband said he thought you were all somewhere doing the jitterbugging. Well, I would be doing it if I had somebody with me, and they started going. I have a third 
even the inside of the home of Hortense Lyles Rouse. The members are coming in the front door and signing in. This is the living room, the fireplace. Oops, I'm sorry. It's all right. Uh, let's see, which one is the class member? Both of us. You both are? Yeah. Okay, your name is? Doc Grant. Doc Grant? Uh -huh. That's what it was back then. <laughs> now, That's what is it now? Dottie Price. Dottie Price. All right, class of 1941. And okay. the other member's name is? Prince Dixon. I'm, Pr I'm Prince Dixon now. It's Prince New. You were Prince Dixon back then? No, I'm, uh -uh, no. I was Prince New, but I'm now Prince Dixon. I oh, think okay. that's what I, I think that's right. <laughs> it was when I left home. The joke class, the husband of the class member that we just took. And you know the one who really well. Oh, uh, oh, thank you. I'm, um, you're, you're I bet you didn't get me with water. An yes, implant, right. He was the catcher. That's right. They're in high school, and he was the first string, and I was the second string. Uh oh. Or the third string. You all not take his picture, boy. I couldn't be first. I couldn't be first hey, until he graduated. How you getting on with this woman? Right. Better known as Izzy. Is this? Izzy. Izzy. I had a nickname, too, when I was in high school. Yeah, George Futrell and I went back in 1943, and you're, let's see, you're Bill Griffin. Bill Griffin, yeah. Class of 41. Uh -huh. Another class member here, and which one is class member? I am. And you're? John Little. John Lewis? Little. John Little. You know, Robin Hood. <laughs> oh. I'm John Little. John Little, and his wife's Martha. name? All right, go ahead with the class. This is the class song, right? Which one is the class member? Right. And your name is? Chris Barnes now. Chris Warren? Barnes. Chris Barnes. What was it before it was Barnes? Quinn. Quinn. And this is your husband? Glenn. Glenn. Which one of you two was the class member? Ray is the class member. And this is Clifton Ray. Mr. Little is going to return thanks, and after that, the barbecue will be served in this area right here. This is Betty Misher as she is look in the class of 1941, goes for high school. Betty Misher as she looks. Wilbur's barbecue is now being served. This is one of my dogs. And one of the class members of 1941 is, what is your name? Bob Harrington. Bob Harrington. All right, I'll stop in a minute and eat me some barbecue. Where well, my husband is. What's his name? Bill Charlton. And what's your name? Sarah Charlton. Okay, I got you on tape. <laughs> and his wife? Uh, that's why I proved it. Tom, you were class of 41, wasn't you? Hey, which one's the class member? Right here. And your name is? What's the class member's name? What's the association? 
Warren. That's nice to see you in. Cheers. I think there's a lot of cheers down here, isn't there? My wife is the member, and I'm just came along to check everything out before we should get back. Okay. That's true, and then the wife is... Brett Snufer. And I'm delighted to be here. I've been here before and had a good time. I expect to have another good time tonight. Cheers. You're Bob Cook. Are you the member? A class member? Sue Boring. Sue Boring. Shubal McClinney. Shubal was David. He used to be my neighbor when I lived on Slocum Street. And his wife, his lovely wife, Edith. And we have another class member. Uh, which one is the class member? This one right here. The older. The, class the older of the two? The one with the glasses. Though. Well, who's that nice looking lady there with you? That's my daughter. That's your daughter? And what's her name? This is better half. Her name is Nancy. Nancy is Nancy the wife, okay. Nancy with a smiling face. That's it. That's the old So we have a class member here, and the class member's name is? Jane Wood Adams, and, and I've got a real good friend right here. And the friend with you? 48 years we've been married. 48 years? I'd say it was real good friends. Oh, well, yeah. After 48 years. We're just really getting to know each other, right? Hilda Smith, Hilda yeah, Bell Smith. A few of the class members are having... Uh, barbecued chicken and barbecued pork on the houseboat overlooking the lake at Walnut Creek. This is the lake. <laughs> Two ball a while ago when I took you and your wife. Yeah. Uh, I don't think I got her name. Edith. Edith. Ann Edgerton. Right. I remember you, Ann. I'm the class of 43. You were in my sister's class then. That was Jean. Jean Edgerton, that's yeah. right. She that's, helped me on some of my test my scores. Dunston. <laughs> and your husband is? Yeah, Dunston. Dunston. All righty. Now we some, see some of the class members sitting out on the uh, patio at the edge of the lake eating this Wilbur's barbecue. More members, or at least one member of the class of 41 Goldsboro High School. Which one is the member? Daphne Whitley. And oh, you're the member? I'm Whitley. Daphne Whitley. And this Daphne is Whitley. Husband. And your husband's name? Jack Goff. Jack Goff? Goff. G-A-W. Goff. G-A-W. All right. These are some of the uh, pictures of the class members as they looked in 1941. Let's get a little closer and see if you recognize any of the pictures. Some of the members are here tonight. Nice, pretty smiling face. Yeah, aren't they beauties? from the class of 1941 Goldsboro High School. This about wraps it up for tonight for the party at the home of Hortense uh, Lyles Rouse. And by the way, we didn't take a picture of Hortense. Yesterday she fell and broke a hip and is in the Goldsboro Hospital. And we hope to have a picture of her to add to this tape in the near future. Okay, now it's recording. My, my name is Frank Summerlin, and my sister Ellen Summerlin Smith is the class member. I'm responsible for all of those pictures that were took preceding this one. So don't blame the camera, blame me. <laughs> How's that? That's great. Okay, thank you. We start our program tonight at the Goldsboro Country Club.
Okay. Using different name badges. Everyone received a badge at the front door. <laughs> the display of uh, pictures of the class members. These pictures were taken, class of 1941, May the 31st, 1986. Some more pictures of the class members as they left in 1941. your name again? What's that? Your name again? Edwin Lee. Edwin Lee. He, 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 he wasn't at the party last night, so we're getting him no, on film tonight. No, I'm not. I just came down from Durham today. Talking to Edwin Lee. He is our special guest tonight. We're glad to have him. Yeah, tell us the story. All right. Uh, uh, first, first what, what, what is your name? Bill Wallace. Okay, Bill. They call, well, my name is Spooks Wallace. Everybody knows me as Spooks. Okay, lay one on us. Hey there. <laughs> a long, long time ago. Is this a long story now? It, well, fairly long. <laughs> I make it short. Okay. And uh, many years ago over in India, there was this young lad, and he heard the story about a lodestone. Uh -huh. And this had a magic property about it. If he took that stone and touched it to any metal, it turned to gold. So he went down and had a chain made to put around his neck. And he decided to make it a lifelong <laughs> venture to look for this lodestone. And he'd go along from town to town, picking up rocks, touch it to his chain, and throw them away. And he'd go along and pick up a rock, touch his chain, and throw it away. And Town to town, and year after year, as time went on, his beard started growing. But he's still on his look for this lodestone. That was his life ambition. Because he knew if he ever found it, he'd have more money than the monarchy of India. He'd have elephants and servants, so he kept looking for this lodestone. And as he grew older, his beard turned white. And one day, as he was going through this village, these three lads were standing over there. Watch it, pick up rocks and touch them to the stone. Uh -huh. The stone to the chain. Throw them away. And one of the kids went over to him and said, Hey, hey, Mr. The old man says, What you doing? I've been all my life looking for a, a rock called the lodestone, which had a magic property about it. He said, If I find it, I can touch my chain and it'll turn to gold. And the kid says, Wait a minute, old man, look, says, Your chain has already turned to gold. And as we go through life, whatever our ambition is, don't throw it away. Well, we appreciate the story. refreshments are being prepared. We have another table which is for the hors d'oeuvres. Looks like we're in business again. Well now here's Shubal McClenny talking to his coach. Well, third table is being prepared. Nice couple here for the first time on tape. And which one is the class member? Okay, you're the class member and your name is? Anna Parker. Anna Parker. What was it in 41? Anna Duke. Anna Duke. And we have Roy Parker. All right. All right. Nice great, to have you tonight. All the members are gathered around now. Having a lot of fun, fellowship. <laughs> and his name is Wyatt Slate. Well, Ro 
roast beef is being served tonight at Hornberry Table. members all lined up. Plenty told me this is something that I can do. I specialize in this thing. I know what you're doing. You're trying to get in your mouth. Goodness, Roy, that was really good. Yes, and I tried the strawberries first, but it didn't work. It's Ernest Cone, we didn't get him on film last night, but we have him now. Enjoying the hard drugs. No, we'll take the short one of your shoe ball. I, everybody's full. get around to my food and we'll eat it and right there it is Ellen Smith my sister is watching over that food and not letting anybody get it Amber you taught me in high school did you teach social science did you teach I'm going to tell you now. This is Miss Sambrin, one of the teachers who taught me in Goldsboro High School. Now this is Mr. and Mrs. Sambrin. And she married Mr. Bess. And what's Mr. Bess's first name? That's, uh, our committee. It's been very, worked very hard on this. Our <coughs> reunion committee is, you know, our basic structure is to have an X number of people who begin working five years hence. Russell, uh, Lewis. <laughs> You know, he sent out uh, the little list of people who are in the house. Those who have died, who, were, who did not have pictures there. But I'd like you to look at this list right now, and if we may, let's have just a moment of silence and remember our classmates with whom we grew up and went to school and think about them and Remember them in any way that you will. Kirby Roundtree, and this lovely wife. Her name is Shelly Roundtree. This is one of the items that has been brought up again this year. Last year, or last five years, expressed the Is in okay, well, this, this concludes the tape of this That's Frank and Libby, woman.
back there and goes for high school. Good spot. 